Hey, welcome to Ultimate Survival Tips. I'm David. Well, in a day where just about every phone has a GPS and map tools built in, a paper map, compass, and some basic land navigation tools may seem a bit archaic, at least until your batteries die, cell service is not available, or the weather turns bad and your GPS goes on the fritz. So today I'm going to share with you the simple old school land navigation kit that I carry with me as a backup to my GPS and to find my way in the woods when technology is not available. And stay tuned to the end for my recommendations and some easy ways to improve your land navigation skills. Come on, let's get started. Let's start with your compass. For our portable navigation kit, I recommend an accurate, durable, base plate compass like this one. There's a lot of junky compasses out there, so stick with a compass from either Silva, Sunto, or Brunton. I'll put links in the video description to help you out. Next, I carry SE navigation cards. Three of the cards contain measurement tools for the most common map scales and are clear so you can overlay them on your map. Two additional cards contain basic topo map symbols, common conversions, tips on reading contour lines, determining distance traveled, declination, finding coordinates, and short-term survival tips. Next, a Sharpie fine point pen is handy to have, as are a few note cards to write on. To hold your kit, this neck lanyard by Hazard does the job at an affordable price. Just slip the SE cards in the back slot, note cards next, compass up front, and pen off to the side. Then use the front strap to keep everything in place. Use the steel O-ring to hook the kit to your pack or use the lanyard to keep your kit around your neck. Just make sure that you replace the fixed clasp with a breakaway set for safety. Finally, you'll need an accurate topo map of the area you're traversing and a way to keep it safe. U.S. Geological Service maps are available for every region in the United States. There's online services where you can print a map to scale and map books like this one from Sportsman's Connection that covers half the state of Pennsylvania. Next, you need to store and protect your map until you need it. Now, you could fold a smaller map and store it in your neck lanyard, but this provides little protection from the elements. So at the very least, place your map in a Ziploc bag, and for better protection, use a waterproof document holder. Now, here's a few tips to get you up to speed on land navigation. The best book that I've ever found on practical land nav with a map compass and GPS is Wilderness Navigation by Mountaineers Books. But to really get you up to speed with basic land nav, the best thing to do is to get out there and take a class or two. My co-instructor Craig Cottle teaches an introduction to land navigation at our Ultimate Survival Challenge Level 1 course. Craig also offers multiple levels of land navigation at Nature Alliance School and on his YouTube channel. I'll put links to Craig's course schedule and YouTube channel in the video description. We've just taken a look at a simple land navigation kit that you can put together to help you find your way in the wilderness. For your convenience, I've included links to all the gear that we've looked at in the video description. Don't forget to subscribe to this channel and the Ultimate Survival Tip Show on Carbon TV. Visit our website for more tips, reviews, and to subscribe to our free survival email. This is David. I hope to see you on the other side. And remember, be prepared because you never know.